Hello, free click class. It's story time with Mrs. Khan. All right. So today my story is about a duck, and this one's a super duck. It's got his look, his eye thing, on his eyes, and he's got the cape, the red cape. We're going to read this story. Super duck. There he is reading his own story, and on the chair, he's put his clothes, just like we all did. There you go. Sheep. Here's the sheep in the farm. Okay, sheep and the frog. Here's the frog. I'm looking for goat. They're looking for goat. He's not in the house. He's not in his boat. I'm here in my shed. He cries with delight. See, that's the shed. He's in here in the shed. Come on, look what I've made. He's made something, a beautiful kite. Come on, you two. Let's see if she'll fly. Shh, now you can throw my kite really high. Me comes a quack, loud and clear. Ooh, who's coming? Make way for Super Duck is here. Quack, quack. He reaches out and grabs the kite, then hurls it up with all his might. So he pushes it up in the sky. Wow. It flips and flaps, it dips and flops, then back down to the ground, it drops it's on the ground now. A kite, says goat, needs more than flying. Someone has to pull the string. Someone strong must run and steer. Make way for Super Duck is here. He grabs the string and shouts out, Go! Then scampers off with the kite in tow. Ooh. It flits and skits and flutters around, but refuses to rise very high off the ground. Hmm. It needs to go faster, thinks Super Duck. I know, I'll use my super fast truck. He zooms down the track with a bump, with a bumpity bump, and the kite at the back goes jumpity jump. It hits a bump with a tumpity tump, the string unties, and then down it slums. Goat says, no matter how hard you try, without any wind, the kite 
it will not fly. Just that moment, goat's beard starts to twitch. Something blows up sheep's scarf with a tickle touch. Sheep's nose, rather. It's the wind, yells the sheep. It comes out to play as the kite takes a flight. Wow, the wind's here. And whooshes away, help. Polar's frog hanging on, on, look at the rear, oh dear, oh dear, the frog's gone high up. Make way, Super Duck is here. He jumps in the truck, vroom, vroom, beep, beep, wait for us, cries goat, we can help, yells sheep. Grab the string, quacks the duck to the goat in the back as the tuck truck goes bumpy bump down the track. The kite is too high, yells the goat. It's not good. Take the wheel, yells the duck. Climbs on the hood. Oh, what is he going to do? It shudders and judders, but Duck doesn't care. He, look, he teeters and totters and leaps in the air. Do you think he's going to catch it? Let's see. <gasps> on the string, onto the string, which whooshes and swings as he climbs his way up. With his super strong wings. The kite begins to jiggle and trash. The tree wolves frog, whales frog, we're going to crash. Duck swoops and he loops. And cries, never fear, make way. Super Duck is here. Slop. Oop. Oop, 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 oop. Goat and sheep call out, where's the frog? Oh dear, says Duck. Who's stuck in the fog? Uh oh, you know where the duck frog is? who shouldn't be on a super cloak, and suddenly they hear a croak. Goat looks up and starts to cheer. Sheep sweeps away, sheepish fear. A shake and stirred, but safe and sound. Frog floats gently to the ground. You saved me, he cries, as he lands in the bog. Whoop. I did, says Doug, I saved my friend Frog. Then goat and sheep run into the muck. Shouting, you're a hero, Super Duck. Woohoo! That's a fun story about a super duck saving a friend. We all like our friends, don't we? We all like doing things for our friends. Well, that's the one, saving them when they need help. Great story. I loved it thoroughly reading it. I hope you liked it too. See you later. Bye-bye.